Hello and welcome to this react.js project series where we are going to create this project from scratch. So let me give you a more in-depth tour of what we are going to be building. So this is the project that we are going to be building. So if I refresh, you will see all the images animates in a spiral fashion. So let me refresh again for you. So as you can see one image comes after another. Same with this list, they also comes one after another. After that we have this quote section, then we have this top shapes section. And then we have this footer and of course this is completely responsive so if i make it smaller as you can see if i make it smaller now they are in two column to fit in smaller devices and then this list have also become inline elements and then the the shapes card as you can see now they have become a card and now they have this box shadow if i expand as you can see now they don't have any box shadow but if i now scale down the page and now they have this box shadow and now our footer have also become two row one is spanning the entire width and the second two are 50 percent and 50 percent of the entire width okay let me expand back and you will also notice that we have this hamburger icon we have made this from scratch using div and if i now click on this as you can see we get this sidebar this also becomes a cross or a close icon we'll also be handling that in css and as you can see right now we are in home page so this home home link is highlighted if i now expand this home here is also highlighted if i now go to recipes page as you can see we again have some animations then we have this search bar and then we have this recipe cards so this this page is also responsive of course so if i now scale down my page they are now one column layout and nothing breaks now the most exciting part is the settings page so if i now go to the settings as you can see you will be able to set the theme so we can we can have light theme or if you want we can have dark theme like so so now our page will be completely dark like this let me refresh back and now we can also change the theme color so for example i can change back to the green and now everything is now with this green color if i want i can make this dark and green like so and now our page is dark themed and we have this green color as our primary color and of course everything else works the same and we can also make our font size smaller like so we can make it medium which is default and we can make it larger like so and if you want we can make our animation speed slow for example so let me scale down my window so if i keep the animation speed slow and click on this as you can see it comes slowly if i make it medium it's a bit faster if i make it fast now everything is fast. So to build this we are going to be using react, we are going to be using sass and we are going to be using the newly released react router dom v6. So we use sass so in that way we will be able to organize our files just like we organized our js file in small pieces like so. And don't worry if you don't know that much of sass I will guide you step by step you just need a really basic understanding of react to follow along with this video. So I hope you are as excited as I am so make sure to like this video, subscribe and turn on the notifications so you'll be notified when i release the next video of this series and i will see you next time